you don't have to look all drab looking you know wearing black jacket just looking sad because winter is here because it's cold what is cold if you like if you're single go and get a puffer jacket it would take care of you just hug you like this my baby just be warm i got uh, in the green because there's too much black on the underground i'm walking on the road everybody's wearing black jackets like nobody died <laughs> Welcome to my channel my name is stephanie and i'm a content creator based in london today's episode guys i'm going to be inspiring your cozy wardrobe you don't have to look in, you know wearing black jacket just looking sad because winter is here because it's cold what is cold if this is your first time on my channel thank you so much for coming please click the subscribe button so you join my family if this is not your first time mwah, thank you so much for coming back when i told the photographer the kind of vibe i wanted she was like okay park will actually be much more suitable for this shoot so we decided to go to regent's park i dragged my box there and then yeah today i'm going to be sharing with you some tips to your looks this season first one i'm going to be talking about tonal looks so tonal basically is looking wearing pieces that are kind of from the same color family how i translated this in my looks was using cream white you can use oatmeal as well like nude you know just to look a bit together but in different shades not wearing just white and white mm -mm. that's not cozy enough that's kind of like a strong look but this lookbook i want it to be cozy so i basically wore a beanie that was kind of like cream an oatmeal color jumper white polka dots skirt it was sheer and then i think white boots so i'm gonna list everything in the description box below so you can see it next thing i did was cape so really think about capes when we're talking wear these days but the thing is cape is just a different way to wear a jumper it's just like a different style it kind of just like has this freeness about it and then when you're wearing capes obviously you have to wear something inside because we're talking warm so we need to be warm we need to be cozy i wore it touching like a pair of jeans and then re really high boots the boots were like knee high boots so warmth was my second name in this look so i wore that and then i also wore a hat um from river island i think yeah because anyway all the links to the pieces are going to be down below and then you see the videos so I wore this hat, which just gave me a lovely look. I tried to take a lot of pictures of this look on the floor with the leaves and the three leaves around just to show you guys how cozy and beautiful I was feeling. The next look was leather. This was actually the leather jacket I spotted for the third look. I wore this over a dress. I just love how this leather jacket is kind of like fitted and then it has three bodies it has this retro look it's not like your normal biker jacket you know where it just gives you like a vibe as well so this was a thrifted piece if i find links a similar item i'll put it in the description box i bought this um the thrift store for 25 pounds i love it it's just beautiful like when you see it you know it's actually rich the fourth look was puffer obviously we all know what puffer jacket um ah it's just a way they hug your life you just feel like if you're single go and get a puffer jacket it would take care of you just hug you like this my baby just be warm puffer jackets oh my gosh i love the one i got i got uh, in the green because there's too much black on the underground i'm walking on the road everybody's wearing black jackets like nobody died just decided to put some color <laughs> on the streets and in my office so yeah i have this puffer jacket once you put your hands inside and then the good thing about mine the lining of the pocket is warm as well you know when you use some kind of fabric to do the inside of a jacket or the pocket it's very annoying because it doesn't warm you this one actually warms you so that's um that's that's the fourth one the puffer jacket so i started this with a pleated vintage um skirt midi skirt with boots we all know midi skirts with boots is such a staple in autumn and winter inside of a puffer jacket you can wear a baggy jumper you know those jumpers that are very very you know warm and then just wear something under as well so that you'll be on point no cold no pneumonia no coughing no flu nothing and the fifth one guys i just called it textures textures um textures textures like i love mixing textures so what i did this time was use tweed i love sets as well i love cohorts i went to zara and then got this um set is a skirt and a hoodie 
but the hoodie is kind of cropped so i had to layer it with something i layered it with a white shirt that white shirt kind of gives me because you know when when anytime i'm dressing up and trying to style pieces i always think of work so that white shirt can just give you that seriousness underneath you can actually this look is actually my favorite look that number fifth look because i just think it embodies metro gypsy it's kind of like serious at the same time very edgy you know i had this high um do and gabbana boots i even have this <laughs> boots just sitting here this is the whatever the boots so i wore these boots and they wore the shirt and i actually wore my husband's shirts to be honest yeah just ready to roll and then the, my hair cut kind of suited that look madly <laughs> like it was just impressive i really love that look i try to put a lot of effort towards accessories because normally guys i don't care about accessories if you already know makeup accessories i don't really take those things so seriously but i should yeah i hope you like all those looks and make sure you enjoy this video take notes and then go shopping all the links will be in the description box just to mention that all my links are affiliate links so yeah i get money if you don't return the items so guys i hope you enjoyed this video take something home make sure you update your wardrobe this is how you should be looking at least one of these trends should be in your wardrobe within this month and then march next year <laughs>the second look i'll probably have to explore the whole not the whole park obviously but just do filming of like different segments of the park just to show you how it looks but it's a beautiful place just walking down to michelle now to take the second look mm -mm -mm.
you so much for watching if you haven't subscribed please subscribe drop a comment because i really love to read from you click the thumb up button whether or not you enjoyed this video see you guys on the next episode bye bye